It's that time of year again. Christmas lights are starting to twinkle around Metro Vancouver. It's always a big job to get them ready to shine. But as Bob Nixon explains, that task is an incredible effort at one famous spot on the North Shore. It is one of those autumn rituals, the stringing of holiday lights. But few places have a bigger job than the folks at the Capilano Suspension Bridge in North Vancouver. Uh, you can fill a huge room with the amount of boxes of Christmas lights we have here every year. James Toft and his crew of five started the job more than a month ago. Endless? It's just getting the, keeping the team motivated, keeping everybody happy. And I mean, you can't be that sad when you're putting up Christmas lights in a beautiful rainforest, right? Unless it's raining. Yeah, we have rain gear, though. The Capilano Suspension Bridge people tell me they have 400,000 Christmas lights here this year, and some of them are pretty high. This is Dave Edgar, vertical guy. It's his job to scale centuries-old Douglas firs to put up lights 40 meters above the forest floor. It's outside. Nobody bugs me up in the trees. Well, sure, who doesn't want to dangle high above certain death? Besides, of course, almost everybody. People can only stare and wonder. But with just a hint of irony, Edgar insists the danger is worth it. No price is too small for the art involved in lighting up the night for the masses. <laughs> okay, so he's joking, but get him down the tree. And his story does not change. It's really fun to hang out up in the trees and, and even just getting up into the trees in the first place is, is part of the fun. This famous Vancouver tourist attraction has only held a December light show for the past six years. What had been the slowest season now attracts as many people as come on the warmest days of summer. Thanks to people like Dave Edgar. Bob Nixon, CBC News, North Vancouver.